Hello guys, this is Deepika from MyTutorialRack.com. Now in this tutorial, we are going to go ahead and look at a very common interview question, which is what is the difference between a master detail relationship and a lookup relationship? We have discussed this question so many times, but still I wanted to stress on how important this question is for the interview perspective because a lot of times employers ask this question. So let's start. What is the difference between the lookup relationship and a master detail relationship? So the lookup relationship is a loosely coupled relationship, whereas the master detail relationship is a strongly coupled relationship. The next thing is there is a field called roll-up summary. Now this roll-up summary field is only available in case of master detail relationship. It is not available in the case of lookup relationship. The next thing is in the case of the lookup relationship, the parent record is not required when you're creating a child record. So if you're creating a child record, if you do not provide the value for the parent record in the child record, then that's fine. Still, you will still be able to create the child record. But parent record is always required in order to create a child record in case of master detail relationship. So parent record is a required field in the master detail relationship, whereas it is not required in case of a lookup relationship. Similarly, the lookup fields are not required on the page layout of the detail record in the case of lookup relationship, whereas in the case of master detail relationship, it is always required on the page layout of the detail record. So you have to have because then only you'll be able to provide the value for that particular field. Another important difference between the lookup relationship and master detail relationship is that you can create a lookup relationship between two custom objects, or you can also create the relationship between standard object and the custom object. The standard object can be on the detail side of a custom object in case of lookup relationship because it's a loosely coupled. When you delete the parent record, the child record will not get deleted in the case of lookup relationship. But the standard object cannot be a child, means you cannot have a relationship between, you cannot create a master detail relationship between a standard object and a custom object where the standard object is on the detail side, means it is on the child side. So you cannot have a relationship like that. You can create a lookup relationship between a standard object and a custom object where the standard object is on the detail side, but you cannot create a master detail relationship between a standard object and a custom object where the standard object is on the detail side or as a child. Now, by default, the record ownership of the child records is not controlled by the parent in the case of lookup relationship. So the child has its own ownership of the record. The parent will have their own ownership. But in the case of master detail relationship, the parent controls the record ownership of the child records. The ch the owner field is not available. It always remember it's not available on the detail record in the case of master detail relationship. So all the sharing rules and manual sharing is controlled by the parent for the child record. So whatever the sharing settings or the manual sharing or whatever the rules are, the same rule will apply for the child record, whichever are applied for the parent because the owner field is not available on the detail record in the case of master detail relationship. You can have a child record without a parent. It means when you delete the parent, the child records will still be available in the case of lookup relationship. Whereas in the case of master detail relationship, when you delete the parent, the child records will get deleted. As I've already given an example, the doctor and patient, it's a loosely coupled relationship. If the doctor leaves, then those patients will be referred to another doctor. Patient does not have to be removed when the doctor leaves, right? So that is what the, the main difference between a lookup relationship and a master detail relationship. Another important point is you can have a maximum of 40 lookup relationship on an object. This number was 25 earlier, but after the summer release, summer 16 release, they jumped up this number to 40. So you can have total of 40 relationships on an object. 
but whereas you can have maximum of only two master detail relationship on an object. And then the final one, you've heard it a couple times now, there's no cascade delete, but in the case of master detail relationship, there is a cascade delete, which means when you delete the parent, the, it will delete the child records as well. So these are the most important difference between the lookup relationship and master detail relationship. I've pretty much covered each and every point that is related to the lookup and master detail relationship. So after this, if any questions comes regarding this topic in your interview, you should be able to answer with all these points in mind.